Hello everyone, this is Joe Charles from the Boyne Golf Academy and we're debuting some of our technology here at the Academy today for this week's video and we're in a software called Coach Now. So this is the video analysis software we use at the Academy and we're also using some launch monitor technology to actually trace the shots of our uh, of our ball flight which is very very helpful for telling us two things the launch angle and the peak height so today was a very windy day out on the golf course and I'm just gonna play both of these and you can see on this one on before as I hit it we're hitting three irons here you can see how high that ball went okay? uh, if we do it on the right hand side this is me trying to flight it down a little bit so today in the video we're gonna talk about what we had to do to produce a little bit lower ball flight there on the right. So we have uh, the high ball flight on the left, the low on the right. So the first thing we're doing is we're trying to be a little more shallow here on the left. You can see as I hit it, not really taking much of a divot, whereas on the after, as we hit that golf ball, you can see that divot being taken. So that's the first thing. We're trying to trap the ball a little bit more on the left versus the right. The second thing you're going to notice is the follow through. So as I followed through here on the normal, you can see kind of a fuller follow through unwinding all the way, whereas after a little bit more of an abbreviated looking follow through. And you can see that ball taking out a little bit lower. The feeling I have as a player when I'm hitting that shot is like my chest is getting over the golf ball and rotating more through here on the right, and my arms aren't swinging through as much. They're a little quieter through impact, which is what's producing that kind of more abbreviated looking finish. Okay, so kind of neat to see that ball flight, see the differences in the trajectory there, and see our video analysis software and how we're able to track movement patterns and really uh, help students understand their swings better. So a little bit different video this week, but thought it'd be cool for you to see some of the stuff we're using.